Okay guys, so here we have a demo of a reverse foot setup. This is the, the more complicated version with a, a few more controls. So all I have to do here is uh, select our control <coughs> and as you can see uh, when we move that up and down the foot would like try to like point towards it which is quite a nice, a nice little intuitive thing that happens. Of course the same happens when we grab the, the hips. We'll always try and point towards sort of like a seek object that that foot control is. Now you'll notice we've got a whole bunch of attributes down here. Now you can call these different things and sometimes I switch them around but uh, we could definitely you know have like a nice ball up type control and you've got all the different options for that so you could actually rotate it if you ever wanted to break the leg or you could uh, you know have him sort of like putting some pressure on the toe left and right. Also we've got a toe pivot so from the side view, if he sort of comes off the toe, you could do that. You could even have a driven key uh, that sort of ramped up and then went to that and then went to the toe, you know, like a roll kind of an attribute if you really wanted to link those two together. I've seen that done a couple of times. <coughs> um, you know, toe pivots, different toe pivots rolling the foot on the from the toe. Uh, now, uh, this is one that I don't put in the simple one, which is really a total necessity in a rig, and that's this toe rotation itself, so we can just rotate the toe completely by itself, which is just a, a nice control to have left and right, and of course we could bank it as well if we wanted to break the toe. Um, second last one is a swivel, so if you're putting out a cigarette we can make it kind of go from there. And then we've also got this bank control which we sort of talked about in the driven key section, so you can bank from side to side on the foot which is uh, you know a fancy little control that we can put in our reverse foot setup. So there you go, uh, there it is. Now I'm going to try and show you guys a little bit what this looks like. So we'll just unhide everything. And you can see there's a little reverse foot sort of setup happening there and that's actually when we take this away actually what's happening under the hood is we've got this sort of like little reverse foot setup that the other foot is trying to match. Uh, with uh, a few different IK controls. Um, there's our pivots for the left and right banking um, and we've even got another pivot in there for our swivel. So one, two, three, four, five different pivots, six, seven different pivots for our advanced version of the reverse foot. This is the advanced version and we'll show a simpler one as well.